Hey guys, what's up? Manas here and this is going to be yet another session and tutorial on prediction of lines. So this is going to be again level 1 and we're going to deal with problem number 2 and it goes like this. A line AB 50 mm long is inclined at 30 degrees to the HP and is parallel to the VP. The nearest end of the the nearest end to the HP is 40 mm above it and 25 mm in front of the VP. Draw the predictions. Okay, so the true length has been given to us as 50 millimeters and this line is inclined to the horizontal plane. So any sort of inclination with the horizontal plane is represented by theta. So theta has been given to us as 45 degrees. Now this particular line is parallel to the VP. Now line is parallel to the VP. It means that uh, its top view, its top view will be a horizontal, a horizontal line parallel to XY, right? I'm going to show you how. Okay, this is the conclusion. I'll show you why um, I've written down this conclusion. All right. Now, before that, we have certain data that we need to write down. The nearest end to the HP. So let us say that the nearest end to HP is NA, and it is 40 mm above HP and 25 mm in front of VP. So HA has been given to us as 40 millimeters. DA has been given to us as 25 millimeters. Fine. So I'll show you this figure. Please watch this. HA. So HA is 40 and DA is 25. So this over here, this distance over here is 40 and this distance over here is 25. All right. Now the angle which you see right from the front is going to be 45 degrees and the true length of the line is going to be 50 millimeters. Now guys, uh, let's uh, look at this from a very realistic point of view. Uh, if a line has been kept in this manner, then the true length of this line can only be seen from the front. Okay, so this is the true length of the line which can only be seen from the front and there you're going to see this line of 50 millimeters and this is going to be 45 degrees. Now this distance is, uh, I suppose this is how much? 25, this over here is 25 and this over here is 40 millimeters. All right, it may appear, this distance may appear very less but please avoid the confusion. Okay, and this over here is with the top view of this line. Now, since this line is parallel to the vertical plane, its top view is absolutely parallel to this reference line XY line over here. And because of this reason, I've written down over here, that is, its top view is going to be absolutely parallel to the XY line. All right, fine. And when you rotate this horizontal plane, you have a reference line above which you have this vertical plane and below this you have the horizontal plane. Now you have to begin by drawing this uh, prediction of this particular point. So H is going to be above, D is going to be below, H we have this as 40, D we have this as 25, A dash A and then we are going to draw this true length of this line at an angle of 45 degrees. So 50 mm long line at an angle of 45 degrees. Then we are going to draw a straight line from here randomly of any length. Then we are going to bring this point downwards until it intersects this horizontal line somewhere down here. So this is going to be the final top view and this over here is going to be the final front view. And I am going to show you by drawing this in CAD. Uh, please watch this carefully. So this is going to be the um, H, H has been given to us as 40. So above we need to go 40 steps. Then down below we need to get 25 steps. This over here is point A dash and this over here is point A. Now we're going to see this true length of this line from the front. True length of this line. True length from the front. Okay, from the front. Um, this true length is 50 millimeters at an angle of 45 degrees. So let's draw this. True length is 50 millimeters at an angle of 45 degrees so that's the true length and this point over here corresponds to point B dash since it's a front view now the next thing to do is to draw a line absolutely horizontal I already told you that the top view is going to be a line which is going to be parallel to XY line and I'm going to bring this uh, produce this line from B dash until it intersects this top view line somewhere here so this is going to be point B Okay, so, and uh, I'll be chopping off this particular portion with respect to about this line and then it should look sign finally something like this. This is our top view and that's our front view. That's it guys. And uh, as far as a little bit of dimensioning is concerned, you can write over here this angle as 45 and one more thing that we have is this dimension is 50 millimeters and as far as this endpoint A is concerned, this is 40 and this over here is 25. Alright. 
So fine guys, that was all from my side. Let's meet again with a new question and with a new set of ideas. And if you have any queries or doubts, you can write them down in the comment section below. So thank you for watching. This is Manas Patnaik signing off. Take care.